Time for another Vodafone Warriors flashback. Now that the days are shorter, colder and wetter, it doesn't hurt to remember the summer months when everyone was having fun in the sun. It also gives us a chance to show you more of the Vodafone Warriors One community work, which goes on all year round. This gathering was at the Howick Rugby League Club. It was part of the Trillion Trust Auckland Rugby League Community Carnival. And judging by the fun these aspiring league players are having, it's a roaring success. And it's not only the kids having fun. Players like Epilahami Luaki remember the days when he was their age. Yeah, when we first started, we didn't have the top team coming out and, and support the young guys. Yeah, for us to do this is pretty good. I think it's just good to rub shoulders with our Warriors boys. Um, you, yeah, you get to see them on uh, TV, but yeah, you know, get the chance to um, see them and hang out with them for a day. Put your hand up, guys, if you play rugby league for a club at the moment. Everyone's really enthusiastic and uh, willing to learn, and, and um, everyone's ripping in, so it's uh, been good fun. You now at the Warriors, we um, always giving back to the community, and you know we got a lot of respect for all our fans. So um, whenever we can, we're out playing with them. You know the supporters have been great to us um, coming to Mount Smart Stadium. So we like to come out and do some um, footy drills when we can, and hopefully they keep coming and supporting us at um, Mount Smart. The drills are a good introduction to the game for the younger fans. For the older kids, it's a chance to impress their Vodafone Warrior heroes. New Zealand the league players are renowned for their skills and that, so you know, you've got to start them young and plenty of the kids out here are really showing them plenty of talent, so it's good to see. OK, so he's going to use full work and I'm going to try to use my initiative. Big word, eh? I'm going to try to use my skills. It's been an action-packed day and the parents and kids are grateful for the Vodafone Warriors' time. Oh, I love it, yeah. Four-year-olds have enjoyed it too, wherever he is. This one's enjoyed it, I think. Checking with the tackle bags, stepping around the and we've also been tackling, um, touching other players. Very good second uh, year that we've come along to their carnival week, so really enjoy it. Kids love it. You know, guys like Ruben Wickey that have been around forever, and he's obviously been doing it for a long time, and it's no effort to him, so it's brilliant. It really strengthens the club and, and gets the public behind them, which is great. One more game, one more line. Born and bred Howard Cornet, so it's great to see the Warriors come down here and. Uh, Show a bit of love for the community. The community rugby league, so it's awesome here. Yeah. Cheers to them. The Vodafone Warriors are into the business part of the season, but community work like this continues throughout the year. No doubt many of these league stars of the future are at Mount Smart every home game to cheer on the team. And they'll be back for more skills training when the Vodafone Warriors come calling next time. <laughs>